In this episode, I'm getting myself some netherite, and I'm going to use it to upgrade my tools and armor. Well, hello, all of you beautiful people out there in Minecraft land. How are you today? I am fantastic. You see that? I almost fell in that great big hole there. I guess it wouldn't have been that bad. It's more like stairs. Anyway, <laughs> how are you? I'm fantastic. Did I say that? Good. Glad. Thank you. My name is Vid. If you have just tuned in, that's who I am. I am, uh, you know, a guy who, who does redstone stuff, and uh, I'm, I'm building a giant game, kind of like decked out. Uh, it's called Relic Runner. But uh, this episode, I'm, I'm going to be taking a little break from that because, uh, well, in the last episode, uh, I played this game. Oh, man, there's so many trees here. Play this game where, uh, I, you know, you were supposed to be the last one alive, uh, and, and I wasn't. I died. Uh, and I had to change my skin. And then when the game ended, the guy who created the game said that we could go back to our normal skins. And, well, I've been wearing a pink suit for the whole season, which is definitely not my normal skin. This is my normal skin, and it feels good. It feels good to be back in this black suit. That's all I can say. There's only one problem. So, uh, l let me show you the problem here. Um, there, look, I, I, armor. I'm allowed to wear armor again. But but look at it. Look, look at look at my armor. It's, it's, it's blue. Um... And normally, I mean, I think diamond armor looks really cool, but for some reason, I don't know. It just feels, it feels so early game to me. And I'm like, what, 11 episodes in now. I feel like I shouldn't have diamond gear anymore. I feel like I need better gear. I feel like I need, uh, well, well, I, I need netherite gear. You, you know that. Oh, well, it's getting dark. Hold on, gotta, gotta, gotta have a quick nap. All right, good, done. Now. I need to get myself some netherite gear, and it just so happens that I know of a great place to get netherite uh, that's that's already made into netherite for me. I don't have to worry about uh, what what effect do I have right now? Oh wait, I got I got cool effects. Nice. Uh, as I was saying, I don't have to worry about mining anything like that. I don't even have to worry about converting you know, uh, ancient debris into netherite because it's already done for me. And that is right over here. Should be right around here. Yes, right over here. Because somebody has gone through the fantastic trouble of mining all this ancient debris and uh, converting it into netherite for us. Yep, look at this. This, of course, is the one and only Onyx who's on our server who's decided this season that he was going to, like, mine just a ton of this ancient debris stuff and convert it into netherite so that he can make every single beacon in the game. You can see he's already got the diamond beacon set up. He's already got gold and emerald and iron and he's working on the netherite beacon. Um, so, I mean, here's the thing. Like, you, you think he's he's a, he's calculating like exactly how much netherite he's got? I, I don't think so. Um, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna borrow a piece, I think, um, and then take it back to my base. Yeah, he won't miss it. And back over to my base now, where I can use this guy right here, the smithing table. Yeah, so I just gotta put my netherite ingots in here. So let's get some netherite out. Perfect. And then, uh, oh yeah, I need smithing templates. Ah, well that that's gonna be a problem. I need the netherite upgrade templates. That's the that's a new thing. I, I don't know why I forgot that. Um, wait a minute. I think Onyx said he had some, uh, but I just stole his netherite. Um, well, he is online. Let, let me message him and see if uh, <laughs> see if he's got any netherite templates. Hi. Hello there. I am in desperate need of that. Exactly what you've got there. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Well, yeah. there you go. Why, you can you can why, take that and, and then duplicate it. Why are you laughing at me? It's just seeing my my silly diamond armor and being like. Well, you know. I mean, I've only not long recently upgraded anyway, so okay. I sort of. <laughs> uh, <yeah. laughs> I, I wasn't gonna, but you yeah. know what? It's like something about uh, being back in the suit and everything. I was like, oh, I kind of yeah. wanna, I kind of need to do it now. So. Yeah, it looks it looks yeah. better with the suit. I think like diamond. I mean, it looks alright, but netherite always just looks a bit better doesn't exactly, it exactly exactly yeah the black and the black i think is gonna is gonna really pop so yeah, that's what i'm looking right, forward definitely. to so thank you do you want any uh yeah. do you want some diamonds for this or anything i heard there were some some diamonds there. oh 
I, I don't really mind if as long as you just return the the duplicated one. Oh, absolutely! Uh, I, I will I will do that. In fact, yeah. I, I could I, I think I need another rack though, so I'll I'll go get that. I have then another, I will. I have I'll another rack in my oh, do you? in my house. Well, let's, oh, let's I mean go. I've I, I've mined a lot of it um, because <laughs> tunnels. I can uh, you have a uh, you have an ender chest here somewhere? Oh, oh yeah, I do. Course. Yep, there's one over in the enchanting area. I see that. I see that. Okay, let's get out. Just a few diamonds here. And then I need, uh, I need a crafting table too. I'm assuming there's one of those here somewhere. Yep, there's one just up here. Back oh, over that's right. Yeah, there. I got one right there. Perfect. Okay, so let's get that. There's one, uh, two. Okay, so here's your nether rack. Here's your uh, template back. And then Thank like, you. I don't know. Here's a. Uh, Here's some, here's some diamonds for you. Just oh, thank you. Oh, thank appreciate, you very much. Appreciate your services. Thank you. Oh, I appreciate the diamonds. Okay. <laughs> right. Enjoy. Take care. I will. Thank you. Oh, scary night. All right, back over here at my base. I now have my netherite. I have my smithing templates, uh, and I think I'm ready to do the upgrades. All right, let's get my armor off here and then into the smithing table. So uh, we put our netherite in, I guess, and then we put our smithing templates in. And then, yeah, let's start with the helmet. Okay, so there's that, and then that, and then that. Okay, so there's our three pieces of armor. And then I'm also gonna need all of my tools. So I'll start with my silk touch, and then my ax, and then my shovel. And then one more for my fortune pick, and that should be good. And we still got two pieces of netherite ingots left over. Uh, boom, boom, boom. And we are now all completely decked out in netherite. Check it out. Oh, feels good. Feels good to be back. Um, well, I, I mean, wh what are you, what are you staring at me like that for? I mean, don't don't you like the new look? Look, it's, it's awesome. Yeah. Okay, I mean, yeah, I'm sure we took advantage of our friend a little bit there. Um, well, we paid him some diamonds. I mean, uh, all right. Okay, I, yeah, I, okay, I do feel a little bit bad. Maybe, maybe we should go, maybe we should actually go mine for our own netherite. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Hello, buddy. 6, come on, get out of the way so I can place number 6 in. 6. Uh, why are you doing this to me? Why are you doing this to me? I'm just trying to play some TNT. Five, four, three, two, one. Uh, sorry, buddy. You're going to have a bad day in just a second here because I decided I wanted to start off with a stack of TNT and just see how much ancient debris that gets me. So here I am out uh, about 2,000 blocks away from spawn. I found myself a nice uh, little area to, to mine and uh, well, let's see what it gets us. I brought my Ignitificator, uh, and it occurred to me that I probably don't need it because I have a flame bow, but uh, since I have it, I'm going to use it right now. Hopefully, uh, hopefully this doesn't go south, so let's just get a little bit out of the way. Hello, sir. You stay right here. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Beautiful. Sorry for blowing up that, uh, that guy over there. Okay. So we got some explosions happening. Not seeing any ancient debris yet. I did also bring myself some potions of fire resistance. Of course, this is the thing you need to do when you are mining for ancient debris. If you didn't know, uh, potions of fire resist are a very important thing. I did, yeah, there it is. I did see some ancient debris. So let's just hop right over here and start pillaring up because we are collecting our first bits of ancient debris right there. Ooh, ooh, and there's two, sweet. And let's just grab this last piece of ancient debris here. Perfect. We ended up getting uh, so far five of them, and it looks like our TNT didn't explode all the way. We've actually got quite a ways to go, and so I'm just going to uh, get a little bit back here out of the way, and then use my flame bow to just finish the job. And let's just duck down here, make sure we don't get caught in the crossfire. Woohoo! Well, it looks like we have accidentally mined our way into a lava lake here, and so uh, we're going to have to take a dramatic turn here. So let's make a little bit of a left over here and uh, keep on mining. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. 
four, three, two, one. And that should be another 64, so another full stack of TNT. And of course, we're not too far from the uh, from the end over here. This time, we are gonna use our little flame bow here. Just back up down this hallway a little bit until the explosions start to happen. There they go. That should be good. Let's watch the excitement, and hopefully we've got some beautiful ancient debris. I see some beautiful gravel falling. Oh, I see it. I see the debris. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. There we go. Stack number three. Oh, and it looks like uh, looks like we found a friend in there. Well, he's, uh, he's not going to last very long, so let's just get this going. A little bit of that, and then dive back down in here, take refuge, and then kaboom, kaboom, kaboom. Let's see what we got now. Three, two, one. There we go. And now we have approached basically four full stacks of TNT. So far with three full stacks of TNT, I've got 26 ancient debris, and this is the last stack I'm gonna do right now and just see exactly how far we get. I love this. And at the end of our four stacks of TNT, we have ended up with a grand total of 32 ancient debris, which is, uh, well, that's, that's great. That's, that's a good number of ancient debris. There's only one problem. You see, I, you know, I stole that netherite block from Onyx and, um, I kind of have to replace it. And, uh, well, that's going to need 36 ancient debris, uh, because that's, you know, four times nine. Uh, is eight, uh, it's 36. Uh, and so, right up here, there you go. I've laid out just a little bit more uh, TNT. So let's just uh, ignite that and get the heck out of here so that we can uh, see if we can collect those last four pieces of ancient debris. And with this last piece hidden in the wall here, I'm, let's just dig around to make sure there's no more. A little bit of gravel, that's about it. Yeah, beautiful. We've got all of these tunnels, which now actually I've blown my way in a big circle right back to kind of where I started here. Uh, and now I have collected, as you can see, 37 ancient debris. So I've got my 36 ancient debris and uh, one to spare as well. So let's get back home and smelt these up. Home again, home again, and as you can see, I still have the fire resistance effect. It's just just wearing off the last few seconds, but I've already smelted up my netherite scrap, and now we just have to combine it with some gold. Let's go right in this crafting table right here, and, well, let's just use the recipe right there. Nine, perfect, got my nine blocks. Get my block of netherite back. Beautiful, and look at that. Look at how gorgeous it is. And yeah, I guess I did feel kind of bad, so I could just uh, plop this guy back right uh, right there. Yeah, and Onyx will never know it was gone. <laughs> but here's the thing. You see, I don't want my armor to look kind of, you know, dull and, and plain and, and ordinary. Um, I actually want to trim it up a little bit uh, because we have these new things in, in Minecraft, these uh, armor trim things. Um, I only have a couple of... I have the uh, smithing template for Ward and I have the smithing template for Silence and I think I can use these to get uh, a decent design. Um, I'm just going to put, uh, I think, Silence on my boots and on my pants and then I'm going to put Ward on my helmet. Uh, but I'm going to duplicate them first because I don't want to basically use them completely. So the first thing I'm going to need is some deep slate, which I have, and uh, yeah, my inventory is full of golden carrots, just to make sure I don't get uh, lost in the whole snotty snot game. Um, oh, I'm going to need some diamonds as well, but I have that here. How many diamonds do you need? You need, I need to make, let's see, one copy, two copies, and then three copies, and three times, I think it's seven, is it seven diamonds? Yeah, it's 21 diamonds. All right, well, let's just do this, and uh, this this out. All right, here we go. Oh, just realized you need cobble deep slate, not regular deep slate. Lucky for me, I have some of that. So let's get this away and let's take this one out. There we go. Now we need, uh, I think I can do this, right? Yes, perfect. So we need at least uh, one copy of silence. Actually, we need two copies of silence. There we go. And we need one copy of ward as well. So there we go. Now we have three of that, two of that. That's exactly what we need. Let's put the rest of our diamonds away. And now that we've got our smithing templates all duplicated up, let's come over here to this fine gentleman here. 
Uh, we need to remove our gear here, so let's do that. Hopefully no one's standing around ready to throw a snotty snot in our inventory. Uh, let's get the, let's see, uh, ward. We said ward was going to go on our helmet. Let's get a little bit of redstone for that one. So that's beautiful. Look at that. Oh, I love it. Then we are going to do silence on our boots. And we need, uh, yeah, we need gold for that one. Beautiful. Oh, that's going to look so good. Lovely. And then we're also going to put silence on here. Redstone again. Nice red pants. Trimmed up. Oh, we are looking good. And there we go. Our new look has been crafted. This is our official Season 3 Igniter SMP look. Oh, I like it. I like it a lot. It's It kind of screams like redstone, but look, it's got a little bit of flair because I got the, uh, the gold kicks down there. I love it. On a more personal note, I definitely appear to be walking on absolutely nothing right now. Walls are uh, are pretty funny in Minecraft. Yeah, check it out. Look, I'm I'm floating above the wall. <laughs> Hitboxes is strange for walls. Um, I wanted to talk really quickly about why I didn't do a project this week. Um, basically, if I have not mentioned it before, uh, I bought a house. Yeah, I'm I'm a first time homeowner. I, I have never bought a house before, and uh, and about a week ago, I actually bought my very first house. Uh, now, the closing date isn't until, uh, you know, mid-March, or close to the end of March, uh, March 22nd to be exact. But it does mean that there's a lot of things I've had to do. So I've spent a lot of time, you know, working this week and a lot of time uh, just running around and getting stuff done for the house. And uh, unfortunately, that has not left me a lot of time to play Minecraft. I did put several hours into, oh, I'm falling, into mining for netherite. So that was something. Um, but I really thought I would have a chance to do a build this week. And it just, uh, it just didn't happen. I've got all the materials. I have a schematic. I have all kinds of things for actually, oof, two, two different builds. Uh, that I'm, I'm ready to do. I just uh, <laughs> haven't had a chance to do them. Actually, three different builds because I have part of Relic Runner. Um, I'll, I'll actually let you in on, on a secret here. I have part of Relic Runner uh, built ready to rebuild on the server. I also have a new storage system. And uh, if you look kind of up there, you might get a little bit of a sneak peek on where my storage system is going to be. Uh, and also, uh, GGJ, I've been promising him that I would get uh, his uh, redstone door built. And uh, I have all the materials collected. I have the space dug. E everything's done. I just have to build this stupid thing. So <laughs> once I have a few minutes to do that, I will. Um, luckily, this coming week, I am actually off work on Monday uh, for family day. So that's, you know, going to be a Minecraft day. So hopefully I will have a bigger, better episode for you next week. Let's get some shaders on for the outro because that, my friends, is where I am going to end this episode. If you enjoyed the episode and you want to show your support, hey, feel free to click the like button and feel free to subscribe to this channel if you want to see more videos and if you haven't already done so, that would be much appreciated. Make sure you check the links out in the description down below to all of the other Igniter members as well. And if you want to see more great content from me, you can check out the playlist on the screen right now. That's got all of my Igniter SMP Season 3 episodes in it. You can also check out the video below that that YouTube thinks you'd like to watch next. Anyway, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode!